episode of Rose and Gold. I'm your host, IK, and this is my lovely co-host, Dr. Ross. Hello, everyone. Dr. Ross and I are back in LA, the city of angels. And right now, we're at one of the places where we originally left off, Little Tokyo. More formerly known as the Japanese Village Plaza. Well, let's take you. That's right. Now, Dr. Ross and I, we're coming into LA because we're working on a feature. I'm actually working on a feature film. But don't don't fret because we're still working on the personals XYZ. That's we're right. We're gonna give you guys an update on that when we get back into Dallas, Texas. But other than that, let's well, show yes, you around. Alright guys, so we're going to start it off with our hot topics for today. Starting it off with LeBron James. Now LeBron James is confirmed to be a billionaire in net worth. Now this wow. is on paper, this is not in full cash, so That's we right. all know what that means. He doesn't have it in cash, he just has it in assets. That's but right. still, thumbs up for LeBron James. Keep thumbs doing up. you. And speaking about that, he actually made a new film called Hustle with Adam Sandler recently. We haven't had the pleasure to see it, but we're going to see it the second we get to the nearest theater to us. That's right, and Adam Sandler's wife is Tiffany Haddish, so, or, or not, is it Queen Latifah? Queen Latifah. Queen Latifah, so let's see how believable this is when we go to watch it, but it's exactly. called Hustle. And our next hot topic is with Kim Kardashian. So you may have seen the news recently with Kim and Pete, and the debacle is just getting worse. Now, in my opinion, I think this is the first time Pete has gone to London. That's right, or out of the country in general. You're right, because Pete has recently been going on many endeavors and trips with Kim. So it's not crazy that he probably went and is probably going around the globe with her right now. That's right. But, but we also know that Kim took Pete there. I guess their plans were to go see the royal family, and they declined Kim from coming in. So, I mean, that was... That was pretty obvious. It's like walking up to the White House and thinking that you can go inside. But and you know, Dr. Ross, this is like a, when they came in. It's with the royals. They're like first class. With Kim coming in there, she's not really all that. That's, That's just right. my opinion. They went but on a private jet. Yes, they actually flew in Kim's private jet that she recently purchased. And you know what? Kim is doing her. She's changing up her Instagram in a little bit more scandalous. <laughs> she might be posting some more... Uh, Hot picks. We don't know. She's been posting that. Let's get into our next and final hot topic. Go ahead, IK. So we're going to be talking about... Johnny Depp. Yes. Johnny Depp has recently won the court case, and he won $15 million. Congratulations, right. Johnny. But, so Johnny Depp didn't win the full $50 million like he was promised, but instead he won $15 million. Which First because he, he should have got the 50 but... Well, 15 is still good. You know, Dr. Ross, I personally think it was good that it settled out like this. Because first off, Johnny was doing this just to get his credibility back. <laughs> exactly. And second, Amber doesn't even have the money to pay Johnny back right now. They're wow. actually still sorting that out in the courts. And the reason why it wasn't... What happened 50, to the money she stole from him before? That money is gone, Dr. Ross. But, you know, Doc, you know, this is a weird sort of topic. This is a thumbs up for Johnny Depp. Amber Heard... Keep on being Amber Heard. That's These right. are all of our hot topics, and we'll see you in the next episode of Rose and Gold. We're gonna go eat something in Little Tokyo. That's right. Possibly have us a bowl of ramen. Bye, Akin.